Hello and welcome to another short video of me, Carl Mitchley of the 10th Essex Living History Group. Today we're going to be looking at how to defarb your small box respirators. These are available from many merchants online, however they're all wrong and they don't look really that authentic. So the first thing we're going to do is take our respirator apart and then use an acrylic or a rubberized paint to paint around the eyepieces. Okay? Anywhere where there is a seam, anti-gas paint was used, a rubberized paint. So we paint around the eyepieces and it doesn't matter if you leach onto the material. If the paint goes onto the material, it's fine because you see this happening on originals. We're also going to paint around where the, uh, the mouthpiece, the exhalation valve goes into the respirator and where all the stitching for, is around the side of the respirator. Here you can see two originals with the anti-gas paint covering the stitching. We also need to paint inside, just like this original here. Again, this is to help seal the respirator against gases. You will need to make your own flutter valve. I used a whoopee cushion and I used the original reproduction flutter valve to make a template. This will then need to be attached to the exhalation valve. Now you can either use tape to attach it or wire or even a tiny bit of string. You see all sorts on originals. Here you can see an original exhalation valve just to the left of where the hose is attached to the exhalation valve. Sorry, an original flutter valve. You can see it's a reddish pinkish colour, just like the whoopee cushion. We then need to use wire to attach our hose to our exhalation valve. And also to our small box filter. As you will notice, I'm using a re an original Second World War hose. Here we have some reproduction items that you'd find in the original SBR in the SBR bag. We have our gas defence leaflet, our gas diary for when worn, and our anti-dimming cream. And here we can see the respirator complete. Now your respirator is ready to be used for your living history events. Thank you for watching. I hope you've liked this video and it's helped you. If you have pressed like, please press like. And you can also subscribe to this channel. Thank you for watching.